Hello, I'm Mike McGue, Chief Commercial Officer for New Scale Power. New Scale Power is a developer of a new type of commercial nuclear energy facility called a small modular reactor. And what we mean by that is we've developed a technology for a safe, reliable, economical, and simple pressurized water reactor. In this picture, we show the typical size envelope for the construction of a pressurized water reactor like the ones that are being built in Georgia and South Carolina in the United States today. In this area, there are many components housed, including the reactor vessel, steam generator components, reactor coolant pump motors, a pressurizer, and many yards of large diameter high energy piping systems that connect the flow of millions of gallons of thermally hot and highly radioactive liquids through the reactor coolant system. In the new scale power module, we accomplish all of those functions within one simple 82 foot tall by 15 foot diameter cylindrical vessel that can be manufactured in a factory and shipped by common modes of conveyance, either truck, rail, or barge. So the new scale power module is constructed of this external vessel, which is the containment vessel, and housed within it is the reactor vessel. Now let me show you a little bit how we use laws of physics to drive the flow of coolant around our reactor system as opposed to relying on electrically operated motors, pumps, and valves. This represents the nuclear core, which is surrounded by water called reactor coolant. The reactor coolant is heated by the fission reaction in the core and by convection rises through this bronze-colored riser tube. The riser tube is surrounded by coiled steam generator tubes containing cooler water. By conduction through the tubes of the steam generator, the heat of the reactor coolant system water is transferred to the secondary coolant, which in turn generates steam and is uh, sent to the turbine generator to generate electricity. As the reactor coolant cools, it becomes more dense and thereby heavier and uh, falls by gravity back to the bottom of the reactor vessel to continue the circulatory process of a natural circulation reactor. Each new scale power module generates 45 megawatts electricity compared to 1,000 megawatts in the larger reactors. New scale power modules can be installed in the groups of as many as 12 power modules in a single installation. The power modules are installed below ground, sub-grade, and in an 11 million gallon common pool of water which serves as the ultimate heat sink cooling source in the case of an emergency. So the plant design and configuration allow us to accomplish something that has never been done in the commercial nuclear industry. This is what we're referring to as the triple crown of nuclear safety. Everyone wants to know what will happen to your plant in a Fukushima-like event. The New Scale plant was designed to withstand a station blackout event which deprived the Fukushima plant from the ability to generate and direct water to keep the nuclear reactor cool and safe. In the new scale power module, in the event of a station blackout, our plant is capable of shutting itself down and cooling itself off indefinitely with no operator actions, no one in the control room to push any switches or throw any buttons, no additional water other than the 11 million gallon common inventory of the pool, and most importantly, no power. No AC power, no DC power, no emergency diesel generators, and no backup battery systems. So how do we know all this works? Since 2003, NuScale has been operating a one-third scale electrically heated prototype, which has allowed us to do complete scale temperature and pressure thermal hydraulic testing of our systems. We're confident that it works because we've demonstrated in this fully instrumented facility with testing for over 10 years.